How to fix the Wi-Fi option not showing up on Windows 11. Method 1. Run the network and internet troubleshooter. Right-click Start and select Settings. Select the System panel, scroll down, and click Troubleshoot. Select Other Troubleshooters. Click Run next to the Network and Internet Troubleshooter. Before moving to the next step, we would like to recommend Combo Cleaner. To keep your device running smoothly, avoid malware infections, and free up disk space, we recommend using Combo Cleaner. Available for Windows, Mac, Android, and iOS devices. Download and install it today at ComboCleaner.com. Grab our limited deal for Windows and Mac users. Use the coupon code PCRISK30 for 30% off at the checkout. Method 2. Disable and re-enable the Wi-Fi adapter. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open Run. Type ncpa.cpl in Run and click OK. Right-click your Wi-Fi adapter, click Disable, and wait a few minutes. Then, right-click your Wi-Fi adapter again, and click Enable. Right-click the Wi-Fi adapter yet again, and click Connect, slash, Disconnect. Enter your Wi-Fi network password, and click Next. Method 3. Update or reinstall the Wi-Fi adapter driver. Right-click Start and select Device Manager. In the Device Manager, expand the Network Adapters list and find your Wi-Fi adapter. Right-click your Wi-Fi adapter and click Update Driver. Click Search automatically for drivers. Windows will install a compatible driver stored locally on your PC. Alternatively, click Browse My Computer for Drivers. Click Browse and select a driver downloaded from the hardware vendor's website. Alternatively, click Let Me Pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Choose a driver from the drivers list and click Next. Click Close. If updating the driver didn't fix the issue or your Wi-Fi adapter is not in the network adapter list, try uninstalling the adapter. In the menu bar, click View and click Show Hidden Devices. Your network adapter should appear in the network adapters list. If it doesn't appear, click Action and click Check for hardware changes. Right-click your Wi-Fi adapter and click Uninstall Device. Mark the attempt to remove the driver for this device checkbox and click Uninstall. Close the Device Manager window. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open Run. Type CMD in Run and hold down Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter keys to open Command Prompt as an administrator. In command prompt, type in shutdown, slash s, slash f, slash t0, and press enter. This command will perform a total system shutdown, since the regular shutdown through the Windows Start menu is only a partial shutdown. Once your PC shuts down, press the power button to turn it on. The full shutdown and restart will allow your PC to correctly recognize and reinstall your Wi-Fi adapter. Method 4. Disable the Network Adapter Power Saving option. Right-click Start and select Device Manager. Expand the Network Adapters list. 
Right click your Wi Fi adapter and click Properties. Select the Power Management tab. Unmark the Allow the computer to turn off this device to save power checkbox. Click OK. Close the device manager and restart your PC. Method 5. Set the WLAN Auto Config service to start automatically. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open Run. Type services.msc in Run and click OK. In the Services window, scroll down and find WLAN Auto Config. Right click WLAN Auto Config and select Properties. Open the Startup Type drop down menu and select Automatic. Click Start under the Service Status section. Then, select the Recovery tab. Open the First Failure drop down menu and select Restart the service. Click Apply and click OK. Method 6. Enable all services in system configuration. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open Run. Type msconfig in Run and click OK. Select the Services tab in System Configuration. Click Enable All. Click Apply and click OK. Click Restart when prompted. Method 7. Enable networking icon in Group Policy Settings. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open Run. Type gpedit.msc in Run and click OK. In the Group Policy Editor, navigate to User Configuration. Administrative Templates. Start Menu and Taskbar. Double-click the Remove the Networking icon policy. Tick Disabled on the left. Click Apply and click OK. Method 8. Reset your network settings to default. Right-click Start and click Settings. Select the Network and Internet panel, scroll down, and click Advanced Network Settings. Select Network Reset. Click Reset Now. Click Yes to confirm the reset. Click Close when prompted. Restart your PC. Hopefully, this video provided you with the information you were looking for. If you're using a Windows computer, we suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. Combo Cleaner's real-time anti-malware scanner will stop malware from gaining a foothold on your PC. Anti-ransomware protection will protect your most precious files against being encrypted by ransomware. Combo Cleaner's web browsing protection will block scams, malicious websites, and downloads. Also, Combo Cleaner's Duplicate File Finder and Big Files Finder will help you clean up your PC and save gigabytes of valuable disk space. Don't let malware wreak havoc on your computer. Download Combo Cleaner today. Thank you for watching.
please consider subscribing to our channel.